I'm back, y'all. And happy new year to everybody watching. The new year 2024 is upon us. And I also have a lot of explaining to do as to why I have been gone for so very long. 2023 has been probably the hardest year of my life. And I'm talking about from the beginning of the year, it was really hard. Then around the middle, like all in between that was kind of hazy. And, uh, you know, some good stuff happened in between there too. And then it got horrible again in December. I'm sick. And I don't want to, I don't want you guys to think I have like some sort of terminal illness or anything. It's not that kind of sickness. I think I have like the flu or something. You can hear, you can hear me, um, in my, in my sinuses a little bit, in my voice, where I'm, you know, I sound a little different and I'm on the cusp of coughing a lot, but, um, something inside me just wanted to make this video because I know a lot has changed. Throughout the time that I have been laying in bed trying to recover from, you know, this flu, I think it is, from body aches to just chills all over my body and, and a runny nose and a very small headache, I've just been, like, laying in bed just contemplating what happened throughout this entire year. A lot of, there's some good stuff that has happened this year, but there's a, also a lot of bad stuff that happened. Some bad stuff turned into good stuff eventually, and then it just ended it with some bad stuff. And again, I, I, I choose not to, I choose not to say what happened, but I'm sick. You know, that's what I'm trying to tell you guys. What, while I was sick laying in bed, I was contemplating, and I was thinking a lot about everything that happened in the past year, and just thinking like, just thinking about my YouTube channel. Everyone's been wondering about what happened to me and like where where have I gone and you know what what actually happened to me. Like nothing nothing bad actually happened to me. Something inside me just wanted me to make this video. Something inside me just wanted to say I need to make this because not only do I owe it to myself, I owe it to the people that subscribe to me. I owe it to the people that watch me, that watch my videos, that subscribe to see me, to see content from me. That's exactly what I came back to do. This is 2024 now. This time, this year is going to be different. I know last year I have been slacking so much because, you know, I had gotten a new job and you know, there's stuff about, like, saving money and stuff, like, thinking about, like, what I want to do, and it hasn't hit me hard until, you know, while I was sick just now. The past few days laying in bed and just thinking about what my YouTube channel has become, and it's been, it, it stagnated, like, it was growing for a little bit, and it grew fast when I started posting shorts. Especially on my TikToks, that was like the easiest thing for me. Just take some stuff from my TikTok, just repost it. I was getting views, I was getting more subscribers. I had grown way more from from those shorts than I ever did making those long-term videos where I was spending so much time recording stuff, spending so much time editing the stuff, re-watching it, making sure everything was pitch perfect. Maybe getting 10, 15 views at best. To just simply laying in bed, picking out a TikTok from my phone, hitting, you know, save, then posting it on, on YouTube Shorts. And what do you know, sometimes I'm getting 10,000 views, sometimes I'm hitting 50,000 views, 60,000 views, that's probably the most I've ever gotten. Then I get like 10 subscribers, 15 subscribers, even 20 subscribers in one day. And that's a lot coming from somebody that has 853 subscribers total. It's not a lot. It's, it's actually like a cork in a drop of a bucket that is the whole conglomerate of YouTube and Google. But just looking and remembering how I started with a nature walk vlog, with my long hair and and the shades and and the hat and 
and and the the kind of like scraggly you know the scruffy the scruffy five o'clock shadow that you see i mean a lot has changed like i cut my hair already um i was in a completely different place in my life than i am now i was only 21 years old at the time of making that well, actually, I was going to be 21 years old because that was a day before my birthday. And I remember I had absolutely no idea, no idea how to work my camera. I had no idea how to edit. I didn't know how to really work the, the seams of YouTube yet. I know how to watch videos, obviously. Every, anybody, know, anybody who's anybody knows how to watch a video on YouTube. That's easy to actually put the work in. To make a watchable, not only watchable, but a watchable and enjoyable video for audiences. That is a challenge in and of itself. And this year in 2024, I'm going to take on that challenge again. And I'm going to come back bigger, stronger, harder. And I am going to bring everything that I got to the table full force. I don't care what anybody says. I don't care what people think about me. I don't care what it takes. I don't care how long it takes me to get to a thousand or even two thousand or five thousand. However many I get, that's fine. Just the journey of it. Just wanting to, just to enjoy doing it again. Because honestly, I had lost the spark. I had lost the joy. I had lost the, the passion of making videos which is something I had I had longed for I remember I begged I begged and pleaded with my dad to get me a camera back in 2018 just a small little vlogging camera that I asked for I remember I just started before I was ready and every day I got one percent better and I mean I'm still not not perfect I mean I still made a few hiccups here and there but I would certainly think that I'm a lot better than I was, you know, five, six years ago. Um, and I cannot believe that I've been on YouTube that long. Like, I mean, okay, like, I would say like five or six years because, okay, I, I had a hiatus, right? A small little hiatus for like a few months. Hadn't uploaded in a while. Um, but that's going to change this year. That is going to full-on change this year. My New Year's resolution is I'm going to come back to YouTube full force. I'm going to start a gaming channel again. Because I don't know if anybody knows this, but my gaming channel got taken down. That's right. The gaming channel that I had, I think it was called uh, Easy Austin Gaming. I had like Donkey Kong Country on there. I had, um, what was it? I had, like, oh, here's one thing. I was setting up for Mario Party, right? I was setting up for Mario Party. I had recorded so many videos for Mario Party. That was the most effort I put into anything that I ever did, ever. As far as, like, a gaming channel, I put more effort into that. And I put my, my main channel on the back burner for a little bit because that took a little bit more effort. But... Gaming was a little bit easier for me, but it was it was just me cranking them out, cranking them out, like, just one after another and one sitting, so that way I could give myself a little bit of a break every now and then, but um, I was in the middle of doing, like, my Mario Party series, and um, I think it was Mario Party 6, and um, the uh, the gaming channel got taken down, and it was probably Nintendo that did it. Because Nintendo doesn't like when people really stream games. I might as well do other games besides that. That's not going to stop me from trying. I'm going to keep on trying. I don't, I don't care. I, I tried way too many times and I'm, I'm, I'm not going to stop. So I'm going to try my gaming channel again. And also, another thing. Yes. See this thing? It's a podcast, Mike. I want to start my new podcast. It's called The Easy Austin Show. I don't know where it's going to go, but it's a new avenue that I'm exploring. It's something that I've been thinking about for quite a while. 
in 2023. I got it for Christmas. Things are, this is going to be a game changer, at least for me. It's going to be a game changer, at least for me. So um, expect a new podcast show. Expect um, a new gaming channel. And expect more from me. The Easy Austin that you knew who loved to do YouTube, who whose passion it was to do YouTube, who, you know, wanted to wanted to do YouTube for a living because he saw other people like Markiplier make millions of dollars doing something so simple that he could just make an empire and make it grow. That's what I want to do. I want to be like that. With the hard work that I put in, hopefully, we can get there together. And I cannot wait to see what we can accomplish together. If you support me, if you tell me what you guys want to see when I upload my podcast, if you tell me who you want me to have on the show, I would love, 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 love for you guys to tell me who you want on the show, what topics you want me to talk about, what games you want me to play on my gaming channel. You're just going to start seeing a lot more of me in 2024 because while I was sick in this bed, I got so angry at myself for letting myself to just let myself become this this paste, this this former shell shell of a man that that just doesn't do anything and he just sits and wallows in his own pity. And he just sits there and he just wastes away and he just rots and he rots and he rots and he just doesn't do anything while the days are passing by and and he just doesn't get on. I'm not going to be like that anymore. Knowing that I had a dream, when I first got this camera, I had a dream. I had a dream. I had a dream that I wanted to be one of the one of the biggest YouTube stars there ever was. And honestly, I hope I get there. I had an inkling in my heart that I could get there because I knew it was so easy for me to do. It was something I'm, I'm, I'm passionate about, about making videos and, and acting and doing, doing voice acting or whatever, anything in like the entertainment space. That's exactly what I wanna do. I actually have some pre-recorded videos that I, have not been uploading. Um, they're actually uploading right now on the channel as we speak. So um, you are probably going to see those maybe the next day or the day after because those are some reaction videos. Those are probably the easiest ones to do. And I hope you guys are prepared to see more of my Aunt MC Benz because she wants to get back into making cooking videos. She wants to get back into making other Urban Dictionary videos or gaming videos because she would love to do all of that and so much more because, because she believed in me and my parents believed in me and you guys believe in me. There ain't any reason for me not to believe in me. Just be prepared for 2024 because it's going to be a wallop. And I'm going to make sure that I do that. I'm going to have a probably a sticky note on this wall right here that says New Year's Resolution. And it's, and it's going to say, and it's going to say, make it to a thousand subs. That's something that is going to be there to remind myself what I said to myself the beginning of the year. And hopefully by the end of the year, I make it to that spot. That's really all I have. So... I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Um, thank you guys so much for sticking around with me. If you have been sticking around with me, uh, just watching my videos constantly, even when I have not been uploading, I thank you so very much for that. Like because of you and because of the support that I have been receiving for all of my shorts, all of my YouTube videos, all of my... Um, just everything that I've been doing, whether it's like Instagram or Snapchat or TikTok or whatever, there's still support out there. And you know what? That's enough to keep me going. So you know what? 2024 is going to be my year. And I know that sounds cliche. And I don't want to say new year, new me because I hate it. Everybody, everybody else says it. And I hate it. 2024 
going to be much more different. I can already feel it. I can already taste it. I can already smell it. That's that's the bottom line. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned because there's more to come. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.